With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Calculate the acceleration of masses 12 kg shown in the setup of the figure. Also calculate the tension in the string connecting 12 kg mass. And the string are weightless and inextensible. The pulley are weightless and frictionless. So if you see, let's say the tension in the string is T. And if we talk about the acceleration. So let's say the acceleration of this uh, 12 kg is in downward direction A, and the acceleration of this 4 kg is A dash. Now let's find out the relation between A and A dash. If you see here, any point on this string will have zero acceleration, and uh, any point on this string will have the same acceleration as as that of this 4 kg block that is A dash. And let's say these points are P and Q. So I will uh, use the average formula to get a relation between the A and A dash. So if you see here, here the pulley, this point of the pulley is having acceleration A dash, and this point of uh, the pulley is having zero acceleration. So the pulley will have an average acceleration of the two point. So I I will write acceleration of the pulley is equals to acceleration of point P plus acceleration of point Q by two. So it will be a dash plus zero by two. That is a dash by two. And acceleration of the pulley will be same as that of the acceleration of the twelve kg block. So you will get this relation. So I can write down a dash is equals to two a. Now. You can write down the force equation. For that, let us break the mg on this m1 mass into two component along the plane and perpendicular to the plane. So, if you see in downward direction, this is acting, and this angle is 30. You can see this is 30. This will be 60. Then this will be 30. So, I will write mg cos Thirty, and it will be m one g sine thirty. And uh, in upward direction, the normal reaction will act, which will be equal in magnitude to that of this cos component, right? So I will only write down the force equation along the plane. So I will write T minus m one g sine theta. Is equals to m1 a dash, right? So m1 g is if you see m1 itself is 40, m1 g is uh, m1 g is 40, so sine 30 is half. So I will write t minus 40 into half is 20. And if you write down the force equation on this 12 kg, so if you see in upward direction. Here, since the pulley is massless, right? So, if if you see the pulley is massless, so net force on the pulley should be zero. So, tension on this string will be two t. So, I will write on the twelve kg block. If you see here, the two t will act in upward direction, and uh, this is twelve kg, right? So, weight will be one twenty newton. So, I will write weight minus two t is equals to twelve into a. Right, so weight itself is this minus two t is equals to twelve a, and uh, the earlier equation was this, and it is uh, I will write t minus twenty is equals to four a dash. A dash is two times of a, so I will write eight a a. Right, so I replace this a dash by two a. Now we want tension as well as acceleration. So first of all, let's get the tension first. So if I write uh, write down this is equation one, so I will um, multiply this equation by two, right, and add the two equation, right. So add the two equation. So if you will add the two equation, you will get a one twenty minus forty is equals to it will be twenty eight, right? Twelve plus sixteen is twenty eighteen.
सो दिस इज वन ट्वेंटी माइनस फोर्टी इट इज एटी Now you can cancel about cancel it by four, so it will be twenty by seven. Now you can check for the acceleration. Acceleration is two g by seven, so in only one option it is present. Now you can also confirm the tension force here. So tension you can see it is a uh, t minus twenty is equals to eight a, right? So put the value in this equation. T minus twenty is equals to eight a, right? So eight a it will be one sixty by seven. So I will write T is equals to. It can be uh, written as this. So it will be one forty. Plus one sixty by seven, so one forty plus one sixty it is three hundred by seven newton. Here we want the tension in the string connecting this twelve uh, kg with the pulley. That is two t. So we want the two t. So I will write t dash. That is equals to two t. It will be equals to six hundred by seven newton. So this is the tension. Now you can also check for the tension here. So if you see. This is um, 600 by 7. Remove this one. 600 by 7. So B is the correct one. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.